Absolutely. We have lots of opportunities available from fundraising to local events and publicity. You can check out our current opportunities page on the website to find out more, or you can contact your local committee to see what they have on where they might need some support. Please do get in touch if you have any questions about volunteering on a continued basis. When you sign up to attend a visit with Sing Inside, there'll always be a briefing beforehand where we go over the kind of key points about communicating in the prison system and that specific prison that you are planning to attend. But in a broad sense, we want to communicate in ways that are respectful and ways that do not cause harm. So for us, that means sensitivity to the fact that everyone is coming to this workshop from a different perspective. People have different musical experiences and they might um, have different levels of understanding of music. And we want to create an environment where everyone is welcome and everyone feels safe to be creative and expressive. Um, that said, there are obviously you know, personal information like your address doesn't need to be shared. But that doesn't mean that you can't be open and honest about your personality. You can talk about things that you like, the sport you like, the music you like, your experiences at university, if you're on one of our student committees, for example, your experiences in the local area, if you volunteer through, say, a choral society with us. So really sharing those things that are personal to you um, and that show people that you're open and you want to get to know them. Um, if anything ever happens that you're unsure about, you don't know what to say, you think that something inappropriate has been said, you have a worry about something that someone has said, you can always raise that with the visit lead or you can raise it with a member of prison staff. And at the briefing, there'll be lots of time for you to ask questions about how to engage with prison residents and staff when they're on the visit. Every prison that we visit has its own security procedures, which might vary depending on the kind of institution it is or the type of resident that it holds. This is why, before every visit, we hold a full, thorough, compulsory briefing session for all volunteers attending that visit, even if they've worked with us before. In these briefing sessions, we incorporate prison-specific information into a wider session on group learning, how to create a fun, safe and productive environment, and what acceptable social contact is. We work really hard with prisons to ensure that everybody in our care feels safe while they're in the prison environment but just in case, we're also covered by full public liability insurance. We make sure that all volunteers have access to a key contact both within Sing Inside and the prison to make sure that all concerns ahead of the visit are addressed, and we adapt our safety procedures as is necessary according to the needs of the prison. After our visits, we often get cards, thank you letters and song suggestions from the residents that we've worked with. For this kind of correspondence, we have a secure PO Box address.